Gray ray mycominicants, which accompany the 10th intercostal nerve, innervate which of the following structures? So here we are asked about the gray ray mycominicants, that is the postganglionic fibers, sympathetic fibers, that accompany the 10th intercostal nerve. And the options we have, option A is the heart. The heart is supplied by sympathetic fibers, postganglionic sympathetic fibers, but these postganglionic sympathetic fibers, they do not accompany the intercostal nerves. They are visceral branches that are derived from the uh, uh, three cervical ganglia and the upper four thoracic ganglia. They are visceral and they don't accompany the intercostal nerve. So the option A in, in this case is invalid. The stomach, the stomach also receives from the sympathetic trunk, but the, the fibers, they do not accompany the intercostal nerves. The fibers that supply the stomach, they leave the sympathetic trunk through the splanchnic nerves as the preganglionic fibers, and these fibers, they will uh, synapse in the preaortic ganglia, and then postganglionic fibers from here, uh, they will accompany the blood vessels to reach the uh, stomach. So it is not through the uh, intercostal nerve. Therefore, the option of the stomach is also invalid. The esophagus, the option of the esophagus is invalid because the esophagus, again, it receives visceral branches that uh, are derived from the sympathetic trunk and uh, they uh, um, do not accompany the intercostal nerve. Sweat glands, which are located in the skin, yes, they are supplied by postganglionic fibers, gray ray mycominicants, because the 10th intercostal nerve supplies the skin of the abdomen. In fact, it's a thoracoabdominal nerve that supplies the skin of the abdomen at the level of the umbilicus. So uh, these postganglionic fibers, they act as a pylomotor on the smooth muscle of the hair follicle, um, as a pseudomotor for the sweat glands and vasomotor. And it is these fibers that accompany the intercostal nerve. Uh, let's check the fifth option. Suprarenal gland receives sympathetic fibers, but these sympathetic fibers are actually preganglionic sympathetic fibers. They are visceral branches from splanchnic nerves that reach the uh, celiac ganglia and the prevertebral ganglia, but they do not synapse in these ganglia. They pass directly into the uh, suprarenal. In fact, they pass to the suprarenal medulla where they synapse with the cells of the suprarenal um, medulla. So again, they are not supplied by any of the intercostal nerves. The intercostal nerves that reach the skin, they carry sympathetic fibers, postganglionic sympathetic fibers, and these postganglionic sympathetic fibers, they are destined for the sweat glands, for the smooth muscle of the blood vessels, and for the erector pylorum um, muscle of the hair follicle.